Hello everybody and welcome back to Extra Holiday Games. I'm Extra Holiday and we're going through some toxic tunnels. Oh, minecarts, that should be interesting. Oh boy. All right, yeah, so, um, hmm. We're getting where I, I'm, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure we're getting near the end of the game here. So, I do expect to beat this in the next few episodes. We'll see. But that's what I'm thinking is going to happen. We'll see, though. But I think so. But we'll see. But that's what I think. But we'll see. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Level loaded. Thank you. Apparently it's very hot in here. Uh, that. That. Hello? I did a risky thing jumping into that while it was, or sliding into it when it was flaming. Okay. Oh, there's, there's just a straight up invisible wall there. Okay, I guess. Ah. Got it. Alright. Uh, right. Get out of here. You as well. Alright, so far this doesn't seem too crazy. Okay. Thought I would, uh... Thought I'd have some traction when I landed there, but that was not the case. And of course, it's uh, exactly when I was talking about how not hard this is. Uh, oh, I don't even need to high jump for that, actually. Okay. Ah, and I uh, oh, uh, got it. Okay, so now. Okay, delayed just long enough not to die there. Wasn't expecting to bounce there. That's what happened. Oh, yeah, I'm just now remembering that I have very few lives. Hmm, this is awkward. Still at risk of game overing. Interesting. All right, it's fine. Well, we'll make it. Oh, hold on. There's a thing I missed back here. Not that I really care, because again, I'm not trying for all the boxes, but I'm going to I'm going to get that anyway. And there's one up here. There we go. OK. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, I'm going to get this just because it's a lot of fruit. No other reason. Yeah, I, I don't think I really like the fire boxes as an obstacle. I just, I don't know. It's like I have to, it's, it's this good thing, but I have to just kind of wait to get it. Oh God, almost died there. It's fine. All right, these things are a little, little more tricky than I thought. Okay, I'm gonna go around you, cause I'm sure if I spin you, you'll probably set off the TNT. Which means I wouldn't be able to get those or that extra life. So, yeah, just, just not going to spin them. I don't have to kill them. Don't have to. Up and up here. Cool. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. Mm hmm. Oh, there's that wall running thing here. Got it. If you jump too early, you jump into the nitro, but I feel like there was a another box behind the nitro yeah okay I don't know how I saw it before but <laughs> turns out yeah there was another thing all right interesting color corded door lock that's what that looks like maybe maybe I need gems for that perhaps Colored gems, which I have not gotten any of. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. 
I didn't mean to jump off there, actually. I meant to bounce higher. That's why I was... <laughs> but it came out as a double jump. You know, we've, we've discussed this issue before, so I guess I don't need to repeat it. But it's, it's interesting. It's just another instance of it. that was meant to be an obstacle. Woo! Haha, <laughs> barely saved myself there. Oh man, I'm getting a whole lot of use out of stalling in the air with the ground pound. Ah, okay, can't grab onto that, good. Kill you, can I? Yeah, I can get under there, okay. Got it. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Oh! Oh, I did not expect that that would burst into flames. Okay, good to know. That can happen. Alright. Now. Okay. There we go. Alright, not even a problem. This is not even a problem. Gotta be ready to go. Like that. Not a problem. Wall running. Do it. Kill. Cool. Oh. Okay, just gonna bounce on this box. I'm not sure where I was going there, actually. Not sure what my plan was, but uh. <laughs> Much like that, my plans did not work out. Hello? Why didn't I not initiate wall run there? Okay. I don't think I have to time my wall run with when that guy goes off. But it seems like that might be the safest way to do things. Okay. Okay. I don't like these guys. Because I never know exactly how much space they're taking up with their hitbox. I don't like, you know what, I'm just gonna break that box. I'm not even gonna, not even gonna bother bouncing on it because that seems like a dangerous prospect, much like touching one of the electric bugs without spinning. I meant to spin there, but it didn't happen. Ah, frick. Well, that works. I'll take the mask, I guess. I'll lose the mask, I guess. That's what I should have said. Anywho, <laughs> we're not here to discuss linguistics. We're here to play Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, see, there's an example of not timing the wall run and then still not getting hit. Okay, cool. Crouch. Yep. Then I get hit by that guy. Uh. 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 Spin. I don't want to bother with that. Got it. Don't get hit by this guy. Okay. Hold on, let's check above first. No, nothing up here? Okay. So spin. Get this. Crouch. I, I really wanted that box. <laughs> I didn't get the box though. I thought I was going to manage to not get hit there, but it did not happen. You. That. 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 Okay. Got it. Got it. Not even a problem. Got him. get this box effectively. Nope. I feel like a spin's going to take too long. I think I have to jump on it. Yeah, that's how you do it. Alright, I figured that out. Pretty easy. Bats. Bats. Why bats? Why? I did not mean to start wall running there. <laughs> 
if you noticed, I wasn't moving very fast when I touched the wall, and then I immediately zipped onto it. So, uh, definitely caught me off guard there. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. just walking into it makes you, like, shoot forward. I feel like I should have to have a certain amount of speed to initiate the wall run, but it just kind of goes. Uh. Uh. Okay. Go. And go. Alright. Got him. Alright. Getting very low on lives again. But it's fine. As long as we're not dying to any more bats. over here bonus level we're gonna we're, we're gonna actually give this one a shot because so we could use some lives also that gave us a view of some kind of hidden boxes and of course they're not gonna make this bonus level easy hmm Exactly what I wanted, but it'll do. Okay, I'm far enough away that the firebox doesn't kill me. Okay, got it. Okay. Now that bounces really fast, which is great. Boom, 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 boom. Nope, wrong timing. <sighs> okay, all right, all right, it's fine. Here. Dash, 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 dash. It's a slide action, but. Alright, so now I have to do this without cheating. I didn't I didn't bounce off of it. <laughs> I just kinda stood on the bouncy box. Somehow didn't die to the fire there. Pretty neat. Okay, there we go. Okay, now I just need to time this correctly. Boom. Got it. Let me just, okay, meant to land on that firebox. Not next to it. <laughs> All right. Very cool. Very nice. Really, really inconvenient that those <laughs> alternate with those two fireboxes. <sighs> would be would be nice if they just went on and off at the same time, but they don't do that. Okay. Yeah. See, <laughs> see, we're not bouncing on the box. Just kind of funny. Bad timing. Ugh. Also kind of funny. If we're being realistic, that's also kind of funny. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. This time for realsies. I shouldn't focus on getting all the boxes in the bonus level because ah. yeah I don't know that that's gonna happen oh hey I timed it right this time well this is awkward got it okay I should not be standing that close Got it. Got it. All right. Can I jump higher than this? No. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. Got it. Got that. There we go. Now we got some stuff going on. Oof. That is quite the trap there. 
Ah, <laughs> uh, that's quite the trap there. You can't just slide there. You have to, you have to, you have to start from a little ways back. Otherwise, you slide all the way through and you die. <laughs> very nice. Very tricky. Very cool. I guess there's only 44 boxes in this bonus level. Got it. Didn't think I was going to land there. Okay. Boom. Got it. Boom. 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 And we very carefully. Boom. There we go. That's how you do it. Okay, so these nitro crates, I assume, will blow up after I hit a a nitro blowing up box thing. Still don't know the actual name for it, but okay. Okay. If you're wondering what my plan was. I was going for the good old hook around, but that's not it. It, it didn't happen. It's fine. All right. We got this, we got this, we got this. It's not even a problem. We got it. Alright. Uh, this time, for realsies. Maybe I should jump over while the TNT is counting down. And that might be good. So that I don't have to risk that. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll try that this next time. This is tricky. This is tricky. This is some tricky platforming, I got to admit. Hmm. I feel like if I were just a few frames earlier in that, on that, it would have worked. So frankly, I'm kind of getting tired of trying at this bonus level. Like I'm not losing any lives, but I am losing time, which is a thing. Top one killed us. I had it down, right? Like I had that down to where I was getting it every time, but somehow now it's not working. Somehow it's not working now. Which is interesting. See, that works. Shit, shit, shit. Well, I'm not getting that one up this run. But let's be honest, the chances of me completing the level in this run, not super high. So, huh. all right, we'll try this again. If only for the practice. Okay, it did not work. I wonder if I slide there over the nitro, if it'll blow me up. Probably, right? Like it's probably how it's gonna happen. But maybe it doesn't happen that way. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's two for that method of dying. Uh, oh. Man, to keep track of how many times I've died and the methods of which I of my death, that would be a monumental task. Should have spawned there. Should have spawned there. Then I wouldn't have, uh, I wouldn't have bounced. 
and I wouldn't have died if I had spawned there. You should have spawned there. I mean, at this point, I'm pretty much just trying to finish the bonus level. I'm not trying to complete it, right? I'm not trying to get all the boxes. I'm just trying to get through so that I can get some of the rewards, at least. But, uh, it's proving to be a little difficult. <laughs> you know what? I should probably hook around the left side. It's probably easier now that I'm thinking about it. Because getting to that right edge of the box seems to be a bit of a challenge. All right. Uh. Whoops. Yeah, okay. That's a, that's a failure right there. That's a, that's a right old, good old fashioned failure. I love to see it. Alright. Woo! Did it. Alright. That time. Just we're just speed running it. Speed running our death. That's what we're doing. Speed running our death. Not the level. Not not even the bonus level. We're speed running our death. So you know, death percent, if you will. Ah, uh, you know that. I feel like I feel like leaderboards for that exists in at least one game. Oh hey, I didn't set off the TNT this time. Until after. I was still close enough, huh? Hmm. All right. All right. I guess that's fine. I'll just uh do it again. All right. Uh. All right. Uh. Uh. Huh, 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 huh. Okay. Got it this time. Okay, let's. There we go. Alright, now we're gonna try and hook around the left side. That didn't work. That didn't work. Oh, maybe if I get on top of the bouncy box to the right, I can then bounce back on t back to the left to get that box. And then, oh, that's probably the best way to do it. Yeah, I'm going to have to come back this way anyway to uh, get the boxes under the nitro. So might just be the best idea to uh not blow anything up beforehand. Alright, so now we're just gonna use the bouncy box to go to the right, and then we're gonna go from that box to the left to get the one-up box. Then we're gonna get back to the right, bounce off the bouncy box again, probably. Or we just blow ourselves up on the nitro. That works too. That is also a possibility, and um, I think that's clear by the fact that it just happened. So yeah, good times, good times, you know? Gotta love playing video games. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, I felt like I was running slow when it came to the TNT, so I felt like I had to distance myself as much as possible, as quick as possible, and it ended up putting me in the fire. All right, 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 all right
that that first jump there is not how it was meant to be handled. Because I'm fairly certain that the way it was supposed it's supposed to work is you're supposed to bounce off the bouncy crate even if you're spinning, but that's not <laughs> I think there might be a bug there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna test my theory here about sliding over the nitro. Hopefully they don't jump the moment I go to do so. Okay, I think that would have worked if I had jumped sooner. Cause I got pretty far without blowing up. Mm -hmm. So maybe, maybe we try an RSJ there and maybe we can even get up on top. Of, I don't think we can get on top of the one up, but maybe we'll try, we'll try. Actually, I could do this from this side, couldn't I? That would maybe make things easier. Nah. Nope, still too close. Should have gone on top and then jumped. That would have been the smart move. Mm. Mm, this little bonus level giving me some trouble. Trying to get on top, but it didn't work. It's fine, 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 fine. Whoops, pushing too many buttons there. All right. This time for sure. This time for sure. Actually, hold on. Eh. Nice. I think that's uh, that's probably how I'm gonna do it from now on. So that seems easier. Now I just have to get off that bouncy box without hitting the nitro. So wish me luck. <laughs> well, I didn't hit the nitro. <laughs> Okay, all right, all right. Okay, no, that's cool, it's very cool. It's, at, least I, it's, at least it's a new way to die. safe now. Everything's fine. No danger here. Okay. Now let's try again. One, two, three, four, five. Got it. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. I think I have to come back this way, but you know what? It's fine. I can probably RSJ back. Uh, although speaking of having to come back, actually, no, this should probably be fine. Frankly, this should probably be fine. I, hmm, hmm, hmm. I didn't actually look ahead of myself before I jumped there. I was just scared because the TNT was going off. So I didn't actually know where I needed to go. Kill that box before it killed me. All right. Oh, there's a ceiling there. 
there's an invisible ceiling there. That's fun. You know, you all know how I love invisible walls and ceilings. Ah, uh, it's great. Why is that there, by the way? Ah, uh, can anyone tell me? Is there any reason that I shouldn't be allowed to go off screen? It's not like I'm gonna run into anything up there, am I? I effed up. Bonus level, this little bonus level, this little bonus level. They're not just gonna hand me lives. It's fine. It's fine. Truly and utterly, it is fine. Okay, this is a visible ceiling. Like over there, it felt like it wasn't visible. Don't need to actually high jump there, which saves me a little bit of time. But, okay. We're good. Bounce, bounce. Slam, slide. Okay. Right. Now we just need to not die. Cool. One, two, three, four, five. Actually gonna leave the flaming box this time. Bounce here. Flaming box. There we go. That's how you avoid death there. All right. This time we, I mean, we don't have to do the hook around if we're not going for all the boxes, but I mean, we're close anyway, so. Good. Good. That's what I wanted. Wait a minute. It doesn't look like there is a explosive or a, a blowy uppy crady. That's not the name, but. It doesn't look like there's a way to blow up the nitro other than TNT and running into it. So I do not know how I'm supposed to get the boxes down there on the bottom right of the screen. Oh wait, hold on. Was there a is there another box there that I missed? Like a hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta look again. Oh no, no, that was just the bouncy box I was looking at. Okay. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Whoops. Whoops. I was goofing around and I died for it. Okay, all right. All right. This time. Okay. This time. Uh, 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 okay. Yeah, all right, we're good. What? What? How did I die there? I was on top of the box, huh? So, what? I, uh, uh, future me, does that make sense to you? Because it didn't make sense to me. Like, I guess I blinked or something, but... <laughs> I'm a little confused about that death. Like, normally I'm willing to accept my deaths, but that one was uh, a little strange. Didn't die this time. Got it. It was a little lower than I was hoping, but it worked out. <laughs> All right. Okay. Just got it. Huh? <gasps> I jumped too early. 
really have no idea how I'm supposed to get those metal crates down there. If there's no way to blow up the nitro boxes there. Probably just RSJ here, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's that's good to know. I don't even have to be don't even have to be on top of the box to make it up there. Okay. All right. I'm gonna try. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna take this because I don't think I need it to get back. I was moving when I spun. That's why I died. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Another try, another try. No, honestly, I was not expecting to be tested this much this early in the session. But, uh, it happened. So, I guess I just gotta deal with it, you know? Sometimes, just gotta deal with it. Ah, oh, right. Let's get that one up. Actually, what am I doing? <laughs> Two, three, four, five. Shouldn't even have to deal with that bouncy box. I'm taking this again. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Uh, I don't think I can RSJ from here to there. Hold on, that was, that was a bad RSJ. Yeah, no, I can't make it there. On top of the TNT. So I do have to do it this way. Hmm. Oh, that is, that is a destroy the nitro crate. It just doesn't look like it because of the lighting. Got it. Okay. Well, then we're going to go ahead and go back and get these because might as well. If we can do it, we might as well. Don't. Hmm. Hmm. Sometimes it's the simple things that are the hardest, you know? Sometimes. Mm. It's fine. Just gotta use all the tricks we learned. Never mind. Never mind. We're doing it the hard way. Alright. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, wait, I messed that up. I'm supposed to take these out first, and then... Okay, well, now... We really are doing it the hard way this time. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Stall. Bounce. Got it. All right. Huh. Get that. I didn't jump away in time. All right, good to know. Funny how uh, one of these bonus levels can take up most of the episode. It's interesting, right? Interesting. You know? It's definitely not frustrating at all! Shit. Ah, uh, yeah, that wasn't gonna work out for multiple reasons. Alright. Alright. Not saying there wasn't anything I could have done to prevent that, but uh, I don't know. 
Ah. Alright. Alright. Bang. 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 Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Yeah, take these out first. Bam. Then I can RSJ from here, up here, onto this. One, two, three, four, five. That was bad. <laughs> I was trying to stall longer, but um, it only really works if you're going to land on actual solid ground. Ugh. Spin. Forgot to spin. Forgot to spin. Forgot to spin. It's fine. <sighs> this time, spin. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, still made it. Okay. Bam. Bounce away for a sec to let that do its thing. Firebox is what I'm referring to. Huh, huh, huh. I missed. I went too far with my RSJ. My RSJ was too R. Ay, 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 ay. Spin, spin. Huh. 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 Let's get on the other side this time. This might as well. Huh. 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 Okay. Bang. Probably could have gotten the firebox, but I don't want to risk it. Huh. Here we go, we've got this. It's just a simple RSJ. Land on the box. One, two, three, four, five. Exact wrong timing. Exact wrong timing on that. It's great. It's great. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I promise I'm still having fun. This is still fun for me. <laughs> mm. Mm. all that out to get that box again on that in that same spree of bounces shit uh, <laughs> same thing happened there as happened the first time I reached that area I uh, didn't really have a good spot to stand it didn't feel like so I jumped forward and jumping forward wasn't safe either so you know what we just we just die. That's what happened. Yikes. Okay. Bounce. Bounce. Slam. Slide. RSJ. Bounce. 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 Wait. Bounce. Okay. Bounce. There we go. Got it. All right. Uh, now. That was like the one that, what's well, seemingly the one jump that is actually required to be a hook around. So.
a one episode batch tonight. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. up and spin the firebox, but I got too close. <laughs> uh, uh, RSJ just for fun. Just cause we can't. Oh, uh, maybe just to blow off some steam. Time it correctly. I mistimed it. All right, all right. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I almost feel like I should just play all of this last part of the game in one sit down, just because breaking it up like I have means that I'm gonna be rusty coming back. You know, to, to record again, because I feel like I don't I don't know that this is actually true, but I think it's been like two weeks since I recorded this game, the, the last episode of this game. So I'm a little I mean, I, I, I hate to blame it on Rust because at this point I've been playing for about 50 minutes, which is about longer than any Rust typically lasts, but it might be the case that I am. That that's what's holding me back. I doubt it, but you know. This was bad, bad timing. Mm -hmm. I could have made that work. I could have made that work. I didn't, but I could have. Bam, 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 You know, I, I played with that song a bit back in the day. I think that was the first time I downloaded Audacity. And because I don't, I honestly don't know what my inspiration was. Well, I, I, for downloading Audacity, that is. But I was like, it's, by the way, if you didn't know, it's an audio recording program. Uh, I don't know what my inspiration was initially for downloading it. I, it, would, it probably had to do with making videos. I, it was probably because I had to record something for something or other. Because I was making videos even before I started putting them on YouTube. Uh, in fact, I think it might have been... I think it might have been my friend's senior project. Or the 
culminating project, I believe we called it, uh, in high school, because he did a uh, he, he did a ad for a fictional game system. Because it was supposed to be like, oh, uh, this is the project. The culminating project was supposed to be like, oh, this is a project that's supposed to represent what you're going to do after high school. And so he went with like, oh, I'm going to be, uh, I don't know, something, something like a. He was basically just BSing, but he was like, I'm going to be, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go into marketing or whatever. And so his project was an ad, specifically a video ad. And I helped him with it because I had been working on videos for quite a while at that point. And, you know, he had some experience, too, but I had a bit more. So I, uh, I helped him record the VO for the ad and I did that with Audacity and then I also edited. But yeah, uh, after downloading Audacity, I was like, you know, I could use this to play around with stuff. And so I did some playing around with songs, one of which being Lavender Town from the first gen Pokemon games. Uh, and I specifically played with that song because up until that point, it was a song that actually scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Just because you gotta know that I was, when I started playing Pokemon, I started with first gen and I was four years old. So Lavender Town was really scary to me <laughs> for whatever reason, probably because of the ghosts and the music and all that, all that. But it was, it was, it was real scary. I, okay. All right. So I found, so I was like, you know what? And you know, as, as a ki kid in my late teens, I still found it scary. So I was like, you know what? You know what I can do to get over this, uh, this, this, this fear of mine? You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna work with the song. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and like remix it into something else. And I kind of, I honestly, I can't tell you whether it was a, a good remix or not, but um, it existed and actually working on it and thus having to listen to the song over and over and over again meant that, uh, yeah, I actually did overcome my fear of the Lavender Town theme. So, yeah, it's a neat little story there. You know, sometimes, and I guess the, I guess the moral is, you know, sometimes to defeat your fears, you gotta face your fears. You know, you gotta face them head on. So, yeah, it's a neat little thing. And then I also started messing with other songs. Uh, I... Oh, I remember one thing I did in Audacity is I... I mixed the song Bad Romance by Lady Gaga with a parody of Bad Romance called Leather Pants by Little Karibo. And I kind of just had them switching back and forth and it kind of worked. I mean, there were some parts where I was missing the instrumental for part of it, but I kind of actually got it to work, which is kind of funny. And I'm sure I'm sure there are plenty of people out there on YouTube or whatever platform now who could do a lot better job than I did back in the day. But it was a fun little project to work on, you know? Oh my God. <laughs> uh, it was a fun little project to work on. Um, you know, I, I enjoyed my time doing it and you know, it got me more familiar with Audacity, which is pretty neat. I still don't know everything about the program because there's a lot to it and as far as I can tell, there's no real, uh, there's no real first party tutorials on it, but it does have, you know, there you can almost undoubtedly find tutorials on YouTube now, though. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't as much of a YouTube watcher back then. So, you know, yeah, I got to play around with it and get to know it a little better. And frankly, sometimes <laughs> the best way to learn a new program or a new tool is just to play around with it for a bit. Rather than having someone tell you how it works, you just figure it out yourself. And I tend to prefer that. I blew myself up again. <laughs> I tend to prefer to figure things out on my own, typically. And then when I when I get frustrated, I'll be like, all right, fine, I'll look, I'll look up how to do this specific thing. Or like if I'm, I guess if I'm 
trying to do like one specific thing with it, then I'll probably just look up a tutorial. But if I'm like, I want to know this thing better, then I, I try to just play around with it myself. You know, given the time. I mean, that's basically, that's basically how I learned how to edit. Basically, I had editing software in front of me and I was like, okay, so like, what can I do? And granted, I'm not going to claim that my editing, editing skills are fantastic, but I did learn quite a bit by just kind of goofing around in uh, iMovie and Final Cut and Premiere those are the three primary ones that I use. Have used, I should say. I don't really use Final Cut or iMovie anymore. I did use Movie Maker at one point, which is uh, not good. Actually, I can't speak to Movie Maker recently. I Back when I used it was 2010, maybe? So it's been a while, but um, Back then, it was it was basically like one step above PowerPoint. <laughs> so, yeah. Frankly, some of the things you can do with PowerPoint nowadays is kind of crazy. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe that's a maybe that's an insult to PowerPoint. <laughs> God damn. Uh, yeah, if you're wondering why I'm not talking about the game anymore, it's just because there's what, what, what else is there to say about this section that I'm doing over and over and over again? Oh, God, this episode's almost an hour long. <laughs> Potentially an hour long, depending on how much longer this takes me. Woo. Hopefully this is the longest episode of Crash. Uh... Ah, uh, but it's fine. Truly, it's fine. I don't mind. There are worse things that I could be doing right now. And... If I'm really being honest... One, two, three, four, five... I don't know that there's anything I'd prefer to be doing right now. Like, there are things I should be doing and could be doing, but... I don't know if shit. Okay, we got it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'd rather be doing anything else. So but we're just going to keep going on this level until it works. Cool. Back. Okay. 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 <sighs> okay. This shouldn't be hard. Just break these. Take the bouncy box back. Just, just gotta land this jump. This is the jump that we need to land. <laughs> okay. We did it. We got lives. So we don't have to worry about game overing as much. I mean, there's still a possibility, but hit the checkpoint, call the episode. We'll do more stuff next time. Cause as for this episode, that's a wrap. Just shy of an hour.